All right, guys, let's talk about what's important for the week. Homeroom. I have a calendar that you need to do. It's linked to Starfall where they can build their own calendar now and do not have to listen to me talk as much. I thought they might like that a little better. You can get all the rest of the stuff in however you want through the week. Art. We have two projects. We're going to draw Rocket and we're going to draw Earth. And then we have a featured artist, Faith Ringgold. So check that out. However you can get it fit in through the week. It's not one of the most important things. Writing is important. Make sure you're doing it every day. There will be a writing lesson on me and a story you need to check out. So go do that. Math, make sure you're doing it every day. Um, no math talk Monday, but we will be resuming math talk Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. You will have an Alpha Plus lesson and a daily lesson. Check that out. Science. You can fit it in however you need to through the week. I've got tons of science stuff on here. So we're going to learn about all about outer space. Our first slide has to do with the sun, the moon, stars, astronauts and rockets, planets, and then we're going to get into each planet. Earth, Mercury, Venus, Mars, Jupiter. We have Jupiter, Uranus, Saturn, Neptune, and Pluto. And a um, game arcade. So fit this in whenever, wherever you need to, but again, it's not something you have to do daily. It can be done after all the main lessons are done, and then they can go explore in their science. For reading, we have all of our videos. We have the reader. We have the um, I Read, You Read. Some videos that will change through the week. And then we have the reader here that you need to read every day. Daily words you need to read every day. Flashcard practice for sight words and flashcard practice for sounds. Those are new things I'm adding. It's a video of me flashcarding. I thought it might help some of the struggling peoples out there. Book club is going to be, this is so cool. Everywhere you see a flashing star, there's a real life astronaut in outer space reading that book to your kiddo. So fit these in whenever, however you can. And then last but not least, if you have a struggling little person at home, you have your um, room to help that. So you have three centers, flashcards. These two books will change. And here's your leveled readers. Easy, hard, hard, or below level, on level, above level is a better way to look at it. So make sure if you ha need extra activities, you're checking that out. And that's all I've got. I hope you guys had an awesome break. Oh, and check out our Junie B. Jones. I'll be adding a couple new chapters every day.